can just be super hard to get a grab on Wario in the first place. So we might not see much of the up throw killing in this set so far. You know, quick shout out to uh, Pike subscribing for 48 months. I think that's longer than me. I think. I don't know. But yeah, thanks for the continued support, Spike. It's always good to see you, man. Hope you're doing well. What? This is Oracle's last WNF? What? What does that mean? Is he moving or something? Dang. This is the last WNF. Oh. Shout outs to War Chief also. 49 months. He's literally sitting next to me right now. <laughs> Shout outs to War Chief. Wait, are you out? Oh, damn. <laughs> no wonder you're still sitting next to me for so long. It'll be okay, man. You'll figure out virus eventually. But anyway, onto this set. YMCA, Oracle. So, it's always uh, interesting for me to see Wario versus like a zoning matchup because in all the time that you're going to get zoned out by these projectiles, you can just be building up the lap. And he has such good air mobility that he can weave around projectiles really well. I think we see this matchup the most with like Quick and uh, Gluttony in Europe. And for the most part, Quick like brings it really close with Gluttony every time, but Gluttony always just finds that clutch factor with like the waft and things like that. So we might see a little bit of that in, a, in this matchup. We'll see. So far, like most uh, stocks tonight, first stock is just super close between both. Ooh, big roll punch. You rarely see Wario's up smash connect, but if you know they're gonna roll in like that, Really good kill option, but Samus has great ledge kill options itself. That bomb just sets up so many things at the ledge. I wonder, can Wario eat the charge shot from Samus? I think he can, right? Yeah, dang, that's <laughs> so. If if he starts like trying to get set up with his charge shot, he can just follow boost to that. I wonder if we even see it. Might not even need it in this situation. Already, this is a pretty big lead for Wario. Like, I, I think when Wario has a assembly like this, he just doesn't have to play risky at all versus Samus. He can play so defensive and wait, but nice F tilt. Such a good catch on the, the ledge there. Pretty active, really strong. Yeah, Wario just has so many good moves, man. That down tilt dash attack's a factor, the lap combos are a factor, F tilt kills. Great edge guarding capabilities with his aerials. We've seen that up B out of shield uh, from Oracle a lot, but still, it's a good like get off me option, but it's not leading to any kills. Now, I feel like, you know, YMCA is perfectly fine with hitting, getting hit by the up B. It's not killing, and it's just still holding on to the WAP as well. Okay, forward throw. Yeah, what, the Warrior's a little bit heavy. Ooh! Dang, he has so many confirms into that down B. It's crazy. I wasn't even sure what aerial he hit to confirm into that. Was that, like, landing there? Yeah, and Simon's being so heavy, that's probably a huge window where that combo works. Either or, dang, really, really good stuff from Warren's here. Yeah, I really want to know why so many uh, DK mains gravitate to Wario. It's like a common thing. Like, Hikaru played DK for, like, so long, and then one of the characters he's really started getting good with in this game once he dropped DK was, was Wario. And then we have Tweak, who, like, I mean, Tweak uses any character, but, like, he's also a famous DK player that's now one of the best Warios. Oh, man, that was so much shield pressure. He could have gotten a shield break, actually. He might have just dropped shield just to avoid, like, getting shield broken at the ledge and dying immediately. Oh, yeah, Oracle's definitely popping off this stock. 
Still not getting touched. Yeah, he knows. He knows he can absorb it. So he just charged it. Oh, I forgot about that dash attack. Zero to death. Yeah, dash attack was also uh, giving a knockback buff. I completely forgot about that. Damn. Yeah, Oracle said, all right, bro. I I'm coming out swinging this game. That was nuts. Really strong first stock. But, uh, yeah, this is this is good for him, man. I Whenever a zoning character gets an early first kill, you, you almost have such an uphill battle when you're the opponent because now they can just run away from you as much as they want and you have no choice but to run into everything. Despite that though, uh, yeah, he's getting clapped up a lot by these up airs. Nice, sees him approaching a little bit too unsafe. That's one of the times where the up B is really good because he's winning and he doesn't really need the up B to kill. Uh, from Samus, he can just rack up safe percent every time Rhyme State jumps on him unsafely. Yeah, stall with the bomb too. So tricky to catch Samus' landing when she's doing that. Nice. Being very evasive right here. Oh, but yeah, risky, risky to have the grab. I feel like Zero Suits is a little bit safer to go for. It might end a little bit faster than Samus's. Hey, there it is. Charge cancel to up B. Yep. Gonna charge up the charge shot. All the way on the other side of the stage. Can't stop him. Charge his move. And that comboed because the weak charge shot tripped him into the dash attack. Shout out to that new buff, man. Samus is not good, but hold up. Getting clapped. He has the walk, man. <laughs> you have to be careful, bro. Now, I wonder if YMCA is doing the thing, because he could have, I think he might have just been able to fly out, kill him with the wall combo, but I guess he wants to save it for the last stock. Yeah, as he should, because he got that D back there. He didn't even need to use the walk. And now, Wario is a killing machine. You hate being in this situation. So now when you mess up, he can kill you at like 40% off a cup. No. What? What? So I said all that about chilling with the combo, but then my guy Oracle was just gonna kill himself. What? What? What are you? What are you? What are you doing? Whoops. Uh, well, we take those as you guys, as you know, we say in turn.